Hi guys! Welcome back to Books and I. I am Mikkel and I thank you so much for being here. Please don't forget to hit that subscription button down below. I will really appreciate it. Today we're going to do our boxing. This is the Owl Crate. Lovely. I'm hoping that this is the Valentine's one because I ordered the Valentine's one because what else are you supposed to do? I'm a book girly. Of course I want the Valentine's special thing that they're doing. It is! A book is a gift you can open again and again. Isn't that true? So this is the liter Literary Love for February. So I'm going to put this aside because it's cheat cheat. Alright. Oh, so in this case they did a box that was themed around love for Valentine's because it's February. And it's supposed to be a special edition paperback. They do paperbacks very rarely. Most of the time the special editions are hardcover. But this one was dedicated specifically to romance, which is not normally one that they do. They do adult, young adult. And now they did a special edition. So inside, we have some hand cream. It is black currant, lavender, and salwood. 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 However you want to say it, that is how can say it. I don't know. But I do want to smell it. Ooh, it smells delicious. Delicious. So I'm assuming this box is going to be full of like self-care items and just pampering yourself. So this is a heart, a heavy burden. Ain't that a fact? So inside we have Owl Heart Cookie Stamp. So roll out a chilled cookie dough on a floured surface, and then you can stamp this. Cute! I was just talking to my friend about um, learning how to make cookies. Because I'm in my baking slash cooking phase of life, I guess. I'm going to put the directions back with it because homegirl needs directions until I get comfortable. And yeah, cookie. I've never really made cookies before. Then we have, is this an enamel pin? It is. It's Anyway So Lover's Enamel Pin, Literary Love for 2024. Oh, this is just beautiful. I love this. Love it. Designs with Love by Af, I mean Af, Ice Raff. Cute. Lovely. Then we have positive affirmation for the bookish soul. Ooh, we love some positive affirmation, don't we? Oh, cool. So it's daily affirmations. Where it's like you are loved, and then when you flip it over, it says you're still a reader when you're not reading. Oh, cute. I am part of a supportive and intelligent community with diverse skills. And then the white ones. So that's the daily one. So this is a bookish one. It says, you got this. Drop that boring book. Drop it. A DNF does not mean failure. So DNF means did not finish. So sometimes when you're really, really like in the book community, sometimes I've noticed a theme with us is that sometimes we don't like to start something and not finish it. And we will try to push through a book that we really, really, really do not like. And it can cause us to be really stressed out because we're trying to force ourselves to complete something or finish something that we don't like. And reading is supposed to be a gateway or a releasing of de-stressing. And instead, we sometimes stress ourselves out. So sometimes to protect our mental health, we should make sure the thing that we're using to help our mental health isn't affecting it. As in, it's okay to say, no, thank you, I don't enjoy this book, let's put it down and find another one that will make us happy because we're doing it to help ourselves de-stress, not to make ourselves anxious. This is lovely. Then we have hot chocolate, and it's called Sunshine, a dose of optimists and strong notes of opposites attract. Cute. And they gave us two. I love hot chocolate. Love it. Yum. Okay, what else do we got? Now we have a grumpy tea. Cherry, caramel, and apple loose leaf pyramid bag from Owl Crate. Lovely. 
Lovely. Is it really loosely? Because I think it is. No. Ooh, it smells delicious. It's positively delicious. Ah. <laughs> then we have a villain lover. Is this a candle? That'd be great if it's a candle. What's wrong, love? Afraid I'll ruin you? Oh, 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 oh. So I think it is a candle. It is. Ooh. Ooh. You are ruining me. That smells delicious. I mean, I'll take it. I'll take it. We like a little um evil in our love lives. At least I do. <laughs> Just kidding. Name one hero who was happy. That's sad. That's true. Heroes, if you really think about it, very similar to villains, are all mentally messed up. So, oh, and then they gave us um, rings. Cute. He's half of my soul, as the poets say. The Song of Achilles, ring set, designed with love by Reader's Society Shop. Adorable. I have not read uh, Songs of Achilles, though I do own it. Well, I don't own it. I think I'm, I'm renting it because it's on a Kindle Unlimited. If you know what Kindle Unlimited is, down and below, I have linked it. Um, I think that is affiliated as um, if you link and then you um, join, I get a small commission. It doesn't change the pricing of anything. But also, I don't think it is either. I, th I don't know. But it's linked down below. Check it out for, I think, like $11.99. You can have unlimited books that you can just read and then return. You don't own them. But uh, if you're an avid reader or someone who just who reads a lot, and it's getting very expensive. This is one way I have chosen to kind of save money is that I pay that and then I get about 20 books that I can rent or put on hold and then download and read. And then once I'm done reading, I just return it. So it's one of the books I have downloaded. So I mean, I should read it so that way I can understand the gift that I was given. Okay. Well, this, what is this? What could this be? What? Oh, what? I really hate this. I really hope it, that they save and make earth with it. This is inspired by Howl's Movie Castle. Love the movie. Just watched it two years ago. Thanks to um, a lovely friend that I met in South Korea. I hope you're doing well for watching this. Um, what is it? Sophie's Flowers Market Apron. Apron. Lovely. So I guess they really thought you were going to be baking it up in this place. Oh, it's a nice, like, um, like if you want to paint, this would be a nice apron for that. I like that. If I was just telling my friend I want to get into um, watercolor journaling, it's just where you, you paint or draw what you're feeling. Maybe it's a line, a quote from a book, and then you use it to um, inspire you to paint something. Or it could just be to paint to paint. Just because I'm trying to get more in touch with my artistic side, and I think this would be a great um, show for it. All right. And then the moment we've all been waiting for, the special edition, it is The Phantom of the Opera. He lays at my feet in my events at my feet and immense and tragic love. I didn't even know this was a book. I thought this was always a play, a musical. So that's really cool that I now have a special edition of it. And I do love the 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 play. So this is exciting. Maybe I'll get to read my one of my favorite plays. That's exciting. So this was the um, literary love box. This was a special occasion. I don't know if they have any extras. They are. Go check it out. I'll put the link to their webpage down below in the description. That's definitely not affiliated. Um, so if you liked what I got and hopefully they still have boxes open, you can go down and swipe yourself one. If not, then um, just keep a lookout. They do special editions or seasonal things or holiday themed ones. And yes, I highly recommend them. Outcrate is my steady one. I always know it's coming. I always get it. And all of the items that I always get from that is of 
good quality and I just I can always say sing praises to Outbreak. I love what they do. I love what they um, how they go about it. And they also are very good with um, trying to build a community for book lovers. And it's definitely they are big on a safe place to come together and talk about books. So I really like them and the app that they recently launched. Launched. So I highly recommend them. Thanks so much for watching. Comment down below what's your favorite item and what or what you would like, what you would enjoy the most with. Please don't forget to like and subscribe because everything you do on this channel really does matter. Thank you for watching. Bye.